Nature of root of a quadratic equation. First, if b square minus 4ac is greater than 0, then the roots are real and distinct. x is equal to minus b plus minus root of b square minus 4ac upon 2a. Second, if b square minus 4ac is equal to 0, then the roots are real and equal or coincident. x is equal to minus b plus minus root of 0 upon 2a. Third, if b square minus 4ac is less than 0, then the roots are not real, imaginary roots. Since b square minus 4ac determines the nature of roots, so it is known as discriminant of a quadratic equation and it is denoted by Greek letter delta. The relation between roots of the quadratic equation and coefficients. Consider the equation ax square plus bx plus c equals to 0 and alpha and beta are the two roots of the equation. Sum of the roots is equal to minus of the coefficient of x upon the coefficient of x square that is alpha plus beta is equal to minus e upon a. Product of roots is equal to constant term upon the coefficient of x square. Alpha into beta is equal to c by a. Formula to remember, alpha plus beta is equal to minus b upon a and alpha into beta is equal to c upon a. Formation of quadratic equation when two roots are given. If alpha and beta are two roots of equation, then the required quadratic equation can be formed as x square minus alpha plus beta x plus alpha into beta equals to zero. x square minus addition of roots into x plus product of the roots is equal to zero. Practice set 2.5. Question 2. Find the value of discriminant. We have an equation as root 2x square plus 4x plus 2 root 2 equals to 0. Comparing the equation with ax square plus bx plus c equal to 0, we get a as root 2, b as 4 and c as 2 root 2. Discriminant b is equal to b square minus 4ac. After solving, we get the answer as 0. Therefore, the value of discriminant is 0. Similarly, we can find the nature of the roots by knowing the value of its discriminant. Question 4. Form the quadratic equation from the roots given below. We have given alpha as 2 minus root 5 and beta as 2 plus root 5. We know that if you are given two roots alpha and beta the equation will be like x square minus alpha plus beta x plus alpha into beta equals to 0. We have alpha plus beta as 4 and alpha into beta minus 1. You can check them after solving as such. The equation is x square minus 4x minus 1 equals to 0. Thank you for watching the academic squad.